The mile is an English unit of length equal to 1,760 yards and standardized as exactly 1,609.344 meters by international agreement in 1959. With qualifiers, mile is also used to describe or translate a wide range of units derived from more roughly equivalent to the Roman mile, such as the nautical mile, the Italian mile, and the Chinese mile. The Romans divided their mile into 5,000 feet, but the greater importance of furlongs in pre-modern England meant that the statute mile was made equivalent to 5,280 feet or 1,760 yards in 1593. This form of the mile then spread to the British colonized nations who continue to employ the mile. The U.S. Geological Survey now employs the meter for official purposes but legacy data from its 1927 geodetic datum has meant that a separate U.S. survey mile continues to see some use. While most countries replaced the mile with the kilometer when switching to the international system of units, the international mile continues to be used in some countries, such as Liberia, Myanmar, the United Kingdom, the United States, and a number of countries with less than a million inhabitants, most of which are UK or US territories, or have close historical ties with the UK or US. The mile was usually abbreviated M in the past but is now written as me to avoid confusion with the SI meter. Derived units such as miles per hour and miles per gallon, however, continue to be universally abbreviated as MPH, MPG, and so on. Name The modern English word mile derives from Middle English MYL and Old English MIL, which was cognate with all other Germanic terms for miles. These derive from apocopated forms of the Latin milia or milia, the plural of mile or mill, literally, thousand, but used as a clipped form of mil passis or parsuum, the Roman mile of 1,000 paces. The present international mile is usually what is understood by the unqualified term mile in British English. The statute mile may refer to the present international miles or to any other form of English mile since the 1593 Act of Parliament which set it as a distance of 1,760 yards. Under American law, however, the statute mile refers to the U.S. survey mile. Foreign and historical units translated into English as miles usually employ a qualifier to describe the kind of mile being used but this may be omitted if it is obvious from the context, such as a discussion of the 2nd century Antonine itinerary describing its distances in terms of miles rather than Roman miles. The mile has been variously abbreviated, with and without a trailing period, as M, M, M L, and M. The American National Institute of Standards and Technology now uses and recommends me in order to avoid confusion with the SI meter and milliliter. Derived units such as miles per hour and miles per gallon, however, continue to be abbreviated in the United States, United Kingdom, and Canada as MPH, MPG, etc., rather than me, H or me, gal. The BBC style holds that there is no acceptable abbreviation for miles and so it should be spelt out when used in describing areas. Historical miles Roman mile The Roman mile consisted of a thousand paces of two steps each. The ancient Romans, marching their armies through uncharted territory, would often push a carved stick in the ground after each 1,000 paces. Well-fed and harshly driven Roman legionaries in good weather thus created longer miles. The distance was indirectly standardized by Agrippa's establishment of a standard Roman foot in 29 BC, and the definition of a pace as five feet. An imperial Roman mile thus denoted 5,000 Roman feet. Surveyors and specialized equipment such as the Disampeda and Dioptra then spread its use. In modern times, Agrippa's imperial Roman mile was empirically estimated to have been about 1,481 meters in length. In Hellenic areas of the empire, the Roman mile was used beside the native Greek units as equivalent to eight stadia of 600 Greek feet. 
The million continued to be used as a Byzantine unit, and was also used as the name of the zero-mile marker for the Byzantine Empire. The million, located at the head of the Mesa near Hagia Sophia, the Roman mile also spread throughout Europe, with its local variations giving rise to the different units below. Italian mile The Italian mile was traditionally considered a direct continuation of the Roman mile, equal to 1,000 paces although its absolute value over time or between regions could vary greatly. It was often used in international contexts from the Middle Ages into the 17th century and is thus also known as the geographical mile. Although the geographical mile is now a separate standard unit, Arabic male The Arabic male was not the common Arabic unit of length. Instead, Arabs and Persians traditionally used the longer Parasang or Arabic League. The Arabic male was, however, used by medieval geographers and scientists and constituted a kind of precursor to the nautical or geographical mile. It extended the Roman mile to fit an astronomical approximation of one dark minute of latitude measured directly north and south along a meridian. Although the precise value of the approximation remains disputed, it was somewhere between 1.8 and 2.0 kilometers. British and Irish miles English mile The Old English mile of the medieval and early modern periods varied but seems to have measured about 1.3 international miles. The English long continued the Roman computations of the mile as 5,000 feet, 1,000 paces, or eight longer divisions, which they equated with their furrow's length, or furlong. The origins of English units are extremely vague and uncertain but seem to have been a combination of the Roman system with native British and Germanic systems both derived from multiples of the barley corn, probably by the reign of Edgar in the 10th century. The nominal prototype physical standard of English length was an arm-length iron bar held by the king at Winchester, the foot was then one-third of its length. Henry I was said to have made a new standard in 1101 based on his own arm. Following the issuance of the Magna Carta, the barons of Parliament directed John and his son to keep the king's standard measure and weight at the Exchequer, which thereafter verified local standards until its abolishment in the 19th century. New brass standards are known to have been constructed under Henry VII and Elizabeth I. Arnold C. 1500 Customs of London recorded a mile shorter than previous ones, coming to 0.947 international miles or 1.524 kilometres. The English statute mile was established by a Weights and Measures Act of Parliament in 1593 during the reign of Queen Elizabeth I. The Act on the Composition of Yards and Perches had shortened the length of the foot and its associated measures causing the two methods of determining the mile to diverge. Owing to the importance of the surveyor's rod in deeds and surveying undertaken under Henry VIII, decreasing the length of the rod by one eleventh would have amounted to a significant tax increase. Parliament instead opted to maintain the mile of eight furlongs and to increase the number of feet per mile from the old Roman value. The applicable passage of the statute reads, a mile hall contain eight furlongs, every furlong forty poles, and every pole hall contain sixteen foot and in half. The statute mile therefore contained 5,280 feet or 1,760 yards. The distance was not uniformly adopted. Robert Mordaunt had multiple scales on his 17th century maps which included continuing local values. His map of Hampshire, for example, bore two different miles, with a ratio of 1, 1.23 and his map of Dorsey had three scales with a ratio of 1, 1.23, 1.41. In both cases, the traditional local units remained longer than the statute mile. Welsh mail The Welsh mail was 3 miles and 1470 yards long. It comprised 9,000 paces, each a three Welsh feet of nine inches, usually reckoned as equivalent to the English inch. 
Along with other Welsh units, it was said to have been codified under Dyfnall the Bald and Silent and retained unchanged by Howell the Good. Along with other Welsh units, it was discontinued following the conquest of Wales by the English under Edward I in the 13th century. Scots Mile The Scots Mile was longer than the English Mile, as mentioned by Robert Burns in the first verse of his poem, Tam o Shanter. It comprised eight furlongs divided into 320 falls or fours. It varied from place to place, but the most accepted equivalencies are 1,976 imperial yards or 1.81 kilometres. It was legally abolished three times first by an 1685 Act of the Scottish Parliament, again by the 1707 Treaty of Union with England, and finally by the Weights and Measures Act 1824. It had continued in use as a customary unit through the 18th century but had become obsolete by its final abolition. Irish Mile The Irish Mail measured 2,240 yards approximately 1.62 statute miles or 2.048 kilometers. It was used in Ireland from the 16th century plantations until the 19th century, with residual use into the 20th century. The units were based on English measure, but used a linear perch measuring 7 yards as opposed to the English rod of 5.5 yards. Other historical miles The German mile was 24,000 German feet. The standardized Austrian mile used in southern Germany and the Austrian Empire was 7.586 km. The Prussian mile used in northern Germany was 7.5325 km. Following its standardization by Ole Roma in the late 17th century, the Danish mail was precisely equal to the Prussian mile and likewise divided into 24,000 feet. These were sometimes treated as equivalent to 7.5 kilometers. Earlier values had varied. The Sialandski MIIL, for instance, had been 11.13 kilometers. The Germans also used a longer version of the geographical mile. The Hungarian mile varied from 8.3790 km to 8.9374 km before being standardized as 8.3536 km. The Scandinavian mile remains in common use in Norway and Sweden, where it has meant precisely 10 km since metrication occurred in 1889. It is used in informal situations and in measurements of fuel consumption, which are often given as litres per mil. Informal situations and where confusion may occur with international miles, it is avoided in favour of kilometres. The Swedish mile formally varied by province from 6 to 14.485 kilometres. It was standardized in 1649 as 36,000 Swedish feet or 10.687 kilometers. Prior to metrication, the Norwegian mile had been 11.298 kilometers. The Portuguese mile used in Portugal and Brazil was 2.0873 km prior to metrication. The Russian mile was 7.468 km, divided into seven versts. The Croatian mile, first devised by the Jesuits Japanglavac on a 1673 map, is the length of an arc of the equator subtended by one-tenth of a degree or 11.13 km exactly. The previous Croatian mile, now known as the Ban mile, had been the Austrian mile given above. International mile. The international mile is precisely equal to 7003160934400000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000
The old imperial value of the yard was used in converting measurements to metric values in India in a 1976 Act of the Indian Parliament. However, the current National Topographic Database of the Survey of India is based on the metric WGS84 datum, which is also used by the Global Positioning System. The difference from the previous standards was 2 ppm, or about 3.2 mm per mile. The U.S. standard was slightly longer and the old imperial standards had been slightly shorter than the international mile. When the international mile was introduced in English-speaking countries, the basic geodetic datum in America was the North American datum of 1927. This had been constructed by triangulation based on the definition of the foot in the Mendenhall Order of 1893, with one foot equals 1,203,937 meters and the definition was retained for data derived from 27 Namibian dollars but renamed the U.S. survey foot to distinguish it from the international foot. The exact length of the land mile varied slightly among English-speaking countries until the International Yard and Pound Agreement in 1959 established the yard as exactly 0.9144 meters, giving a mile exactly 1,609.344 meters. The U.S. adopted this international mile for most purposes but retained the pre-1959 mile for some land survey data, terming it the U.S. Survey Mile. In the United States, statute mile normally refers to the survey mile about 3.219 mm longer than the international mile, while most countries replaced the mile with the kilometer when switching to the international system of units. The international mile continues to be used in some countries such as Liberia, Myanmar, the United Kingdom and the United States. It is furthermore used in a number of countries with vastly less than a million inhabitants, most of which are UK or US territories, or have close historical ties with the UK or US. American Samoa, Bahamas, Belize, British Virgin Islands, Cayman Islands, Dominica, Falkland Islands, Grenada, Guam, the N, Mariana Islands, Samoa, Saint, Lucia, Saint, Vincent and the Grenadines, Saint, Helena, Saint, Kitts and Nevis, the Turks and Caicos Islands, and the U.S. Virgin Islands. The mile is even encountered in Canada, though this is predominantly in rail transport and horse racing, as the roadways have been metricated since 1977. U.S. Survey Mile The U.S. Survey Mile is 5,280 survey feet, or about 7003160934721869. meters. In the U.S., statute mile formally refers to the survey mile, but for most purposes. The difference between the survey mile and the international mile is insignificant. One international mile is exactly 699999998000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000000
state legislation in the U.S. is important for determining which conversion factor from the metric datum is to be used for land surveying and real estate transactions, even though the difference is hardly significant, given the precision of normal surveying measurements over short distances. 24 states have legislated that surveying measures be based on the U.S. survey foot, 8 have legislated that they be based on the international foot, and 18 have not specified which conversion factor to use. Nautical mile. The nautical mile was originally defined as one minute of arc along a meridian of the Earth. Navigators use dividers to step off the distance between two points on the navigational chart. Then place the open dividers against the minutes of latitude scale at the edge of the chart, and read off the distance in nautical miles. The Earth is not perfectly spherical but an oblate spheroid, so the length of a minute of latitude increases by 1% from the equator to the poles. Using the WGS-84 ellipsoid, the commonly accepted Earth model for many purposes today, one minute of latitude at the WGS-84 equator is 6,046 feet and at the poles is 6,107.5 feet. The average is about 6,076 feet. In the United States, the nautical mile was defined in the 19th century as 6,080.2 feet, whereas in the United Kingdom, the Admiralty nautical mile was defined as 6,080 feet and was about one minute of latitude in the latitudes of the south of the UK. Other nations had different definitions of the nautical mile, but it is now internationally defined to be exactly 1,852 meters. Related nautical units The nautical mile per hour is known as the knot. Nautical miles and knots are almost universally used for aeronautical and maritime navigation. Because of their relationship with degrees and minutes of latitude and the convenience of using the latitude scale on a map for distance measuring, the data mile is used in radar-related subjects and is equal to 6,000 feet. The radar mile is a unit of time, equal to the time required for a radar pulse to travel a distance of 2 miles. Thus, the radar statute mile is 10.8 microseconds and the radar nautical mile is 12.4 microseconds. Geographical mile The geographical mile is based upon the length of a meridian of latitude. The German geographical mile was previously 1 15th of a degree of latitude. Grid system. Cities in the continental United States often have streets laid out by miles. Detroit, Indianapolis, Chicago, Phoenix, Philadelphia, Las Vegas, Los Angeles, and Miami are several examples. Typically, the largest streets are about a mile apart, with others at half-mile and quarter-mile intervals. In the Manhattan borough of New York City, streets are close to 20 per mile, while the major numbered avenues are about 6 per mile. Metric mile. The informal term metric mile is used in sports such as track and field athletics and speed skating to denote a distance of 1,500 meters. In United States high school competition, the term is sometimes used for a race of 1,600 meters. Comparison table. A comparison of the different lengths for a mile, in different countries and at different times in history, is given in the table below. Leagues are also included in this list because, in terms of length, they fall in between the short West European miles and the long North, Central and Eastern European miles. Similar units. 1,066.8 meters, versed, see also obsolete Russian units of measurement.